guys welcome back to another bass build today i have this trio bass design called triumvirate this bass is perfect for a trio or even a duo setup if raiders pick the quickest way to your tc they will have to invest around 30 rockets and this doesn't account for the three external tcs keeping in mind that raiders will again have to invest more depending on how much loot they are willing to get if you guys are new here, be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, so sit back, relax and enjoy the building progress.
suggest to leave this half full wood so that later on it's easy to soft side out that's why the door frame was left in wood so it just makes it easier for you to soft side out later on if you have enough resources now to complete this stage you won't have to actually place this half full but if you can't get there just do the half full wood and you can soft side and add it later Also, if you guys are finding it hard to follow with the speed of the video, you can go to the playback feature in the video settings and slow it down just to make it easier. I do this just to speed up the video so it doesn't drag out for too long. Now we can soft side the door frame out and the half wall that's placed above it. This will let us place a sealable bunker for when we go offline just to make the base that little bit stronger.
Right now I'm showing the final upgrade of the core and the bunker so you can aim towards doing this whenever you have the materials ready I'm just going to do it now to speed up the video so you should aim towards something like this So if you don't know already how a sealable bunker works, you place a twig half or here when you go offline. This allows you to place a triangle floor on top. So you upgrade the triangle floor to match the surrounding foundations or walls. And the only way raiders will know this is a bunker if they hold out a hammer and the stability isn't 100% only foundations will be 100% stability so this is just a good way to strengthen the base when you're offline and whenever you're ready to open the bunker all you do is spawn within your bunker and just get out a rock or whatever and smash out the twig and the bunker will collapse and open now I'm just placing here a drop box that is hidden behind this tier 3 workbench. The only way raiders will ever know that you hide good loot in here is if they raid your main base TC and all the three external TCs. Otherwise they won't have the option to pick up and grief anything within your base.
this stage that we've added our disconnectable external TCs. If your main base TC gets destroyed, you won't be able to place it back in place after the Raiders have been there. So to do this, you have to go to each external TC, place down this twig foundation and roof, which disconnects them all. Go back to the main base, place down your TC back where it was, and then you can go back to each external TC, break the twig, and then you can place this square frame back in place and upgrade them all to sheet metal. Now you can add two more external TCs the exact same way as the first one. Just follow where I start off the TC placement and you can go from there. three external TCs and three gatehouses. You can wall this in with either wood walls or stone high walls, it's up to you. And then just build your compound however you want it really. A simple way to place these barricades on top of the gatehouses is by placing two twig triangles like I am. This will give an extended range on where you can place the barricades and then just demolish the twig after you are done. So thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this base build. If you're new here be sure to like and subscribe to stay posted with all my upcoming base builds every week. So thanks again guys and I'll see you in the next one.